First gen cephalosporins narrowly fight gram minus germs in soft tissue infections and surgical prophylaxis. Their best parentarily go throughout the body and leave mainly through the kidneys. They're transformed variably. Their best parentarily go throughout the body then leave mainly through the kidney. They're transformed variably. Second gen ones are used for abdominal infections. Their spectra medium are germs they fight are gram minus. Their best parentarily go throughout the body, then leave mainly through the kidneys. They're transformed variably. Their best parentarily go throughout the body, then leave mainly through the kidneys. They're transformed variably. Third and fourth gen ones do have broad spectra against gram plus. Less than first gen, they're active, but more than second gen for gram minus. Their best parentarily go throughout the body, then leave mainly through the kidneys. They're transformed variably. Their best parentarily go throughout the body, then leave mainly through the kidneys. They're transformed variably. They sometimes cause allergies, like penicillins can cause. Excess prompts toxicity. Don't take them with alcohol. Their best parentarily go throughout the body, then leave mainly through the kidneys. They're transformed variably. Their best parentarily go throughout the body, then leave mainly through the kidneys. They're transformed very.